Hey guys, it's your dating coach Emre from KamalaiStyles.com. Imagine hitting a home run with every woman you approach. That's every guy's fantasy. So that got me out in the streets today to find out from gorgeous women what are the signs she should sleep with a guy. Yes, fellas, today we are going to find out what we have to do to get freaky after the date or over-the-counter conversation. As you know, women are slippery. Sometimes you might feel like things are rolling high only to be left dry. Well, unless you're getting it from the red street, women like to assess the guys who they would give access to the golden gates. Is there a particular character that women look for in guys they sleep with? Do women have different standards for a one-night stand and long-term relationships? I'll walk the streets and talk to as many beautiful as women as I can to give us clarity on today's topic, so stay tuned. Girls, tell me, what are the signs you should sleep with him? <laughs> Come on, really? Handsome? If they not it, put us! They smell nice. If he's got big energy. If he's funny. He's taller than me. Good looks. Good looks. Good chat. Big <laughs> Tell me why. Because it feels good. Definitely sixth date and um, you kind of really get each other on an emotional level. So why emotional level? Because when you have sex with someone and it's a physical thing, it's the next day you can think, oh God, that was fun at the time. But actually, if you've had the emotional connection, then you tend not to feel sort of uh, uh, a bit embarrassed the next day, I suppose. You need to have gift of the gab and more of a tan than me. You need to be like nice ethnicity. That's what I'm looking for anyway. Big energy is the only sign you need. Why? Because why would you want to have small big energy? If he's somewhere that I am, because good crack obviously, and if he's from Yorkshire or Newcastle, if he's a northerner, then that's where it's at. Why funny guy? Because it's just good crack, isn't it? If he's sexy, if he's respectful, if you're attracted to him, if they're funny, and if they're over six feet, if he buys me a lot of clothing and drinks. A basic sense of self-respect and respects you as a person if the woman wants to have sex I mean you don't have to be in love with them he's respectful oh. yeah. he takes no as an answer he's nice but not too nice nice but too nice not too nice that's the, no, no if they're nice how about you yeah if they're kind I, they're kind yeah and like make me feel good about myself big hands smell good preferably taller than six foot oh, if they treat you like a princess or a queen if they inspire trust very rich is the guy's sex game important I'm a virgin. <laughs> what's important is if he has had a long-term relationship if he has had a long-term relationship it means he knows how a woman works I guess to an extent yeah why is that who doesn't like good sex yeah and good chat too. yeah I think so. and good chat though good chat all the way yeah yeah I feel like Boys just should be nicer, so... Yeah, if he's gonna make me come, then that's great. Yes. Why? Well, because I also feel like it's also important for a relationship, like you can't have sex with someone, like you can't be with someone who's not good at sex. Yeah, yeah, how he works it in the bedroom is very important. Like, it gets boring, you know, if he's doing the same thing. He needs to jazz it up. I like a bit of role play. Of course, yeah. and girls too. Yeah. It's we equally important. Yeah, it is, but if, you're, if you get on with him, then you're kind of... I feel like okay, why is sex game is important it's not just like it's sex and like getting on with someone isn't separate if you get on with them then your sex is good sort of thing yes uh, yeah why it is important now for you to enjoy it I think if you match the drive then both of you will enjoy it it's more pleasurable yeah, yeah yeah if you're not gonna give me sex a lot of the time then what makes you crave a guy then? compassion I guess the feeling that no woman can provide <laughs> <laughs> For me personally, I've always, always wanted to be with someone tall. If they keep you on your toes, yeah. like when you don't think they're that into you, that makes you like them more. Mm. So disinterest know? crave you more? Yeah. I okay, uh, nice, got a good chat, like... If he makes me horny, I don't know if they're funny, if they're funny, if that's... <laughs> funny, funny at six months. That's really funny, yeah. Tall, great conversation, uh, intellectual conversation. Um, Two different girls, I guess. Same values, I guess. That's attractive. And also, humor. Girls love a funny guy. Oh, he could be missing a lot of things, but if he's funny, yeah. he'll get far. It's <laughs> accents, yeah. Good accents. Good personality. Good personality. Yeah. Zodiac compatibility. Yes. <laughs> yes. He doesn't want me, then I want him. Good 
smile. Smell? I mean, like, if you're horny. Lol. Probably when I haven't been with a guy for a long time. Obviously, good looks, good personality. Would you sleep with a guy who you can't date? No, I don't think so. In the old days when I was young and beautiful, yes. Yes? Probably not. I, I'd have to look at them and think, oh, why? Good chat with them. Because it's a personal thing, like I wouldn't sleep with anybody. No, because he's off limits. No. No? 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 It doesn't matter. I don't have you ever done it? No. <laughs> If you're interested in no strings attached, not breaking any rules, they're not married or with someone else, I guess there's nothing wrong with that. If you both want the same thing, that I think that's fine. It doesn't, it doesn't, it's not a problem. No, potentially yes. Yes. Yeah, it makes it more attractive. If they, you can't have them, it makes you want them more. I'd say that's for general rule. No, I wouldn't either. Why? Just waiting for the right person. Maybe. <laughs> Have you ever slept with a guy you never dated? I always know that they're available. Like, I w wouldn't sleep with a guy that's not available. Yeah. I feel like stuff like that never ends well. I don't know. I feel like someone's bound to, like, catch feelings and stuff. Wow, gentlemen. I didn't expect some of the answers that I got from those beautiful ladies today. There you have it. Signs that will put you on a women's wanted list. Mastering the art of flirting allows you to build sexual tension. That will make it hard for a woman to actually say no to you. It's challenging for a woman to sleep with a guy. She has noticed his intention is just sex. It's good to be genuine about your intention, but how you package it is crucial. Women want to feel that the decision to let you hit it is inspired by her. I hope you enjoyed watching the video. Please leave a like, share and subscribe if you are new to the channel. We also have amazing ebooks, products and offer services that are guaranteed to improve your game with women. Visit KamalaiSaz.com by clicking the card above or following the link in the description section. Thank you so much for watching. I am Emre. See you next time.